My name is Kumari Silva and I call myself a very, very proud Old Wesleyite. I joined school way back in 1968 in grade one and I left in 1980 after 12 long years. And I'm happy to call myself a total Wesleyite. My entire school education was at Wesley College. If I were to look back at my years at college, the 60s and the 70s, I would go back to a glorious era of my life when life was less complicated when life was simpler, when we had time to interact with human beings, uh, to look at nature, and we were not immersed and, uh, and stuck in our mobile uh, electronic gadgetry. I'm not saying it's bad, but at that time we didn't have anything of that, so we could mix, we could talk to human beings and look at the world around us. Um, of course, it was of an era. If I were to look back as to what college did for me and has made me, I would uh, point out two attributes. One was, I think, simplicity. Uh, we were taught to be simple, humble human beings. Uh, our heads are uh, firmly stuck on our shoulders and our feet on the ground. Uh, and yes, nobody is God's gift to mankind. We all play our, our role in life and then we move on. You know? we, we just move on. That was one. The other one was, I think, uh, humility and gratitude. Uh, giving back and helping people, of course, yes, I, I do thank all my old teachers from grade 1 to grade 12 every single one of them uh, all of them made me what I am today I need to of course single out one of the greatest principals of Wesley College Arthur Shelton Vera Singer whose English I speak and whose English I write uh, so yes yeah, so all these people they contributed and I believe in school but also needs to be a kind of a blotting paper because you need to absorb you need to imbibe and absorb and and take in things that you learn yes we learn from sports we learn from from academia we learn from everything around us so I think all that put together has made me what I am today and I certainly am extremely grateful and proud and thankful to Wesley College for making me who I am today uh, the other thing is, of course, I need to thank my French teacher, Mrs. B. A. Fernando, uh, who taught me French and that, and my German teacher as well at college. And uh, that opened the doors of the world to me, and I'm so thankful to Wesley College for that as well. Now, having said that, I, I was a Wesleyite for 12 years of my life, and now at 60 years, I, I am more of a Wesleyite out of school than I was in school. And that goes for all old Wesleyites. Uh, and then you, I go to ask myself, look, I, I took from the school for 12 years, but now I need to give back. So we need to, as Wesleyites, as grateful, proud, humble Wesleyites, all of us, irrespective of race, color, religion, age, creed, all that, we need to ask ourselves, look, let us give back to college also. So it's a journey. Uh, the journey hasn't finished. The journey was not over. When I left school uh, 41 years ago in 1980, it continues. So I'm still in touch with Wesley College love to give back, love to interact with the boys. So, ora et labora, this goes on. It will go on and on until I breathe my last one day.